In light of this news, our trade correspondent Yi Soo Jin takes a closer look at what's special about South Korea's nuclear power reactors and what potential challenges lie ahead. The selection of the country's Korea Hydro and nuclear power as a preferred bidder to build at least two nuclear reactors for the Czech Republic will likely mark the beginning of further advancements into global markets. In a briefing held on Thursday, Trade Minister An Dokun said the achievement, which comes 15 years after the nation won the bid to build the Baraka nuclear power plant in the UAE, will open the door for further exports to Europe. This project involves the construction of up to four large-scale nuclear reactors said to be the Czech Republic's biggest ever investment project. It establishes a foothold for exporting nuclear power plants to Europe, the birthplace of the first commercial nuclear reactors. The two nuclear power units to be built in the Dukovani region are APR-1000 reactors, the smaller version of the APR-1400 reactors previously built in the UAE's Baraka nuclear power plant. The APR-1000 will produce around 1,000 megawatts of electricity, less than the APR-1400, but more suitable for the Czech Republic, which has a smaller electricity demand. APR-1000 is a sister plant of APR-1400, which is, uh, you know, a third-generation nuclear reactor. It has a much higher, you know, uh, safety uh, capability and uh, lots of, uh, you know, uh, provisions in case of something happened in the nuclear power plant. And compared to France's EPR-1200, the APR-1000 is more affordable, as it costs almost half of the around $11 billion it cost to build the EPR-1200. And it was also certified by the European Utility Requirements Association last year, meaning that it has met more than 5,000 requirements, something France's EPR-1200 has yet to obtain. But there are still challenges ahead, namely with the ongoing legal dispute with U.S. nuclear power company Westinghouse, which filed a lawsuit against KHNP in 2022, claiming that the APR-1400 uses its intellectual property. The expert, however, is rather optimistic. Uh, but, I, as a, but I think that uh, KHNP is somewhat you know, uh, uh, better positioned than before. They are trying to solve it you know, uh, through the... Uh, uh, you know, discussions and conversations rather than the, uh, uh, solving it to solving in the uh, uh, courtyard. Currently, the finalized contract is to be signed by March next year with construction to start in 2029 and operation to begin in 2036. Isujin, Arirang News.